write PDF, but you know, because I teach my son about firearms and safety, being his grandfather was a gunsmith, I'm creating a school shooter. And that Bobby, his daddy knows exactly what the fuck I bought him, you idiot. It was his father that was the gunsmith, dummy. And he's, he quite likes it. He thinks it's fucking awesome. <laughs> idiots. So I implore you, I am dying for one of these idiots to contact my child's school. The school that is very much aware of this YouTube situation, and they're waiting for it too. Because the minute they do, gotcha, bitch. Now you are absolutely guilty of cyber stalking an autistic child, and you'll be charged accordingly. They're waiting for it. Everybody's anticipating your next move. So continue with your stupidity. I don't give a fuck. I'm not the one going to be sitting in a fucking cell being somebody's fucking butt plug bitch. You will. And for those that aren't versed on Minnesota laws, threats of violence, the intent to terrorize, whoever threatens directly or indirectly to commit any crime of violence with the purpose to terrorize another or to cause evacuation of a building, place, this assembly, vehicle or facility of public transportation or otherwise, to cause serious public inconvenience or a reckless disregard of risk causing such terror or inconvenience may be sentenced to imprisonment for not more than five years or payment of a fine, not more than $10,000. What is a felony stalking charge in Minnesota? A person who engaged in stalking with respect to a single victim or one or more members of a single household which the actor knows has reason to know would cause the victim under circumstances to feel terrorized or to feel bodily harm, which does cause this reaction on the part of the victim is guilty. They blackmail, making false accusations online, publicly posting derogatory statements about a victim, posing a victim online to cause harm to their life or career, tracking someone's online activity or location. And again, let me play it one more time for you for those that missed it. Well, Nikita, there are people who have money that are out here on the YouTube. I'm just saying uh, different ones. But if you go after their kids, I mean, it wouldn't surprise me at all if I got up one morning and it came across the screen, uh, uh, screen uh, Huck was shot for what she's doing. That's how devastating. I think mm. I'd be pissed. I'd get in my car and drive straight to your ass and invite you out and probably put a bullet in you. That big a deal. Shit. And who is she talking to in that first clip? None other than Nikita. It's Nikita sitting next to that dumb fucking heifer, threatening my fucking life, and says, hmm. Well, Nikita, I thought you were a victim. Is that the behavior of a victim, Reaper? Uh, no. That sounds more like somebody that's just psycho. That's somebody engaging in a terroristic threat, which is a felony in Minnesota. That's a felony in a lot of states, actually, to tell you the truth. Yeah, it's time that the law gets involved and actually does their job. And to ensure that it gets done and the cops don't try to go, well, uh, the lawyer absolutely makes sure it happens. That's the beauty about having it legal. I think the police departments just like to blow it off. Well, we ain't got no jurisdiction. Yeah, you do. Under the federal laws, it states that they have jurisdiction now to take care of the situation, get the evidence in the, that is needed to stop this cyber cyber attacks and threats because of the fact that they've been happening in different states. Well, they're doing it to an autistic child. Yeah. Uh, Liquor Lyle said that people. for people wondering why her stream got removed, it's because she said that my child should turn the gun on himself and pull the trigger. That's why her stream was taken down. Can't say things like that. No. 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 They frown on that. YouTube fails at their job. 
they don't take care of the problem. I don't give a fuck how much money YouTube has to pay me. I don't give a good goddamn. It don't matter to me. But some people need to understand that the laws have changed. And the police Massive. can and will come onto the res to get your ass, white lady. You see, you'll see. They're coming for you. Don't worry. It's coming. I've attacked nobody's children. I don't even attack these fucking idiots. But there they are daily. They're they're live right now. Restreaming. Don't bother privatizing your stream, bitch. I record every one of them. I keep it for evidence. Duh. I mean, the cops, it's amazing watching their faces. They just sat there listening to this fucking idiot. And they just shake their head. She ain't the brightest bulb in a tree. According to uh, Nikita, she needs to get uh, actual legal advice and maybe pass that on to this fucking half witted retard so she stops fucking up and producing irrefutable evidence for me. I love it. I appreciate it. Thank you. Actually, they need to start looking at each other because the majority of them have been putting it out that the cyber laws and all that have changed under the federal government. They've run it through the Supreme Court. They are putting that information out. My, hello, if you're not going to pay attention to what you're actually putting out on your own live feed and knowing that that shit could go against you thinking that it's not, uh, sorry, that don't work that way. It's a 